Hi, Distance Families. Just me touching base again. I wanted to let you guys know a couple things. So first off, on Monday, October 5th, I have an appointment in the afternoon, so I will not be getting on our Google Meet, but the following Monday, I will have that set up and running again. Um, I know some of you have been like, hey, kid has questions about this or struggling with that. Still shoot me those emails, but the best way for me to help them is on that Google Meet or asking me to do a Google Meet on one of the other days just with them. I can give you strategies on how, how to help them, but realistically, if I'm gonna help them, the best way for us to be successful is them to jump on that. So I know some of you got comfortable with Zoom last year. Google Meets is very, very similar. Um, I sent the link out a couple times near the beginning of the year. If you can get into our math Google Classroom, there's a link right at the top built in. It's the same link every Monday. You. The kids just click it and they're good to go. If you need it, let me know and I will send it to you again. I also sent it to the kids in their Pathblazer Messenger so that they have it on their laptop in case that helps as well. So if the kids are struggling with the subject, I would love to help them. Google Meets is how we do that. It's the best way because I can see them, I can share my screen with them, I can pull up what they did and we can really look at it when I'm talking to you, I can give you some strategies, but it's not quite the same. So every Monday, 3 to 3.30, I am on that Google Meet, and we can always set up a time for me to do it on the other days as well. Not this Monday, but please, please use that time. I'm there. I want to see the kids. I know you want them to talk to someone who's not just you, and it's the best way for me to help them with those strategies. And I can do things like their sight words and stuff with them then as well. Also, if your student is on a reading accelerated plan or a wrap plan, one of the progress monitoring systems I have to do is a map fluency and it lets me see exactly how they're doing. I will need to schedule times to do that with those students next week. So if you know your student has a wrap plan, and if they do, you should know about it because you had to sign off on it last year with their teacher or the year before, then I will be contacting you so that we can set up a time so I can get on a Google Meet session with them and they and I can do their math fluency so I can keep progress monitoring them. And we also are going to have another tool to help them with that reading fluency and boost it a little bit. This one is better than Pathblazer at boosting that reading. It only has reading, but it is better at boosting that reading. So as soon as I can get all their passwords and things to you, we're gonna ask that that is something you start doing with them. You can take off their social studies time or their science time from Pathblazer so that they can give a half hour to that instead. So they would be doing still their two to three sessions in math on Pathblazer, their two to three lessons on Pathblazer in ELA with language arts in both of those in that Odyssey folder, and then a half hour in this new program that I'm gonna get you the passwords to. We just set it up this week, so be patient as I figure it out as well. But that way, they're getting all of that, and then they can pick social studies one day, science the other, whatever it is, so that you're still not having to go over that two hours. Obviously, more than the two hours is great if the kid is up to it. Working on their Pathblazer folders is going to help them fill those holes, but that two hours is dedicated to that on grade level stuff in Odyssey and this new reading program I'm going to be sending out to you. If you have any other questions, of course, feel free to contact me. You all are doing a great job of staying in contact, answering my calls, shooting me emails. It's going great. Thank you so much for your communication and let me know if there's anything else that you're struggling with. 
we need to pass out, whatever the case may be. Have a great day, guys.